Kamal here and I welcome you all to one of our Windows 10 mobile video tutorials. In this video tutorial, we will let you know how to get a phablet UI on a device of size, uh, display size less than 5 inches or even if you want, you can get a, uh, you know, a non phablet UI on a phablet. So what I have in my hand is a Lumia 640 XL. So usually phablets uh, with Windows, running Windows 10 mobile will have the ability to pin four medium sized tiles on the start screen and they will have five action buttons in a row. But as you can see, this Lumia 640 XL only has four action buttons in a row. And if I go to uh, the start screen, it will be ability to only have three medium sized tiles here. So how to achieve this or how to achieve a phablet UI on a device that has a display size of less than five inch. So what you can do is to go to all settings, system, then display. And here you can see I have, uh, we have a slider which says size of text, apps and items on this display. I have made it maximum in case of Lumia 640 XL and the UI has changed from phablet UI to a non phablet UI. If I to, uh, I mean, kind of uh, move the slider to left and make uh, put it in middle and apply it, it will do a restart now. So when it, once it restarts, what will happen that it will take me to the UI, uh, which is the normal UI or the phablet UI for Lumia 640 XL. So you have to remember this, that if you have a device which has a display size of less than five inches, you have to you have to move the slider to the left or reduce the slider or text size or the and and then in that case the uh, number of tiles will increase on your uh, on the display and number of action buttons on the uh, in the action center in a row will also increase so let's see how it works <clears throat> let it uh, reboot So as you can see, now uh, <clears throat> I have uh, five action buttons in a row. So that's already there. And if I now move to personalization, start, and here I can do show more tiles. And now I will be back to the normal phablet UI where I can have five, uh, sorry, four medium size tiles in a row. So this you can achieve on a uh, device with a display size of less than five inch by moving the slider to the left. So now if the question arises that what will happen if I move the slider more because it's possible on this device. So it will again restart. But uh, <clears throat> in case of uh, devices with display size less than five inch, you would have only one option to go uh, or reduce the you know slider, move on the slider to the left. So with that, you will get a phablet UI and the size of the text also decreases. In case of phablets, if you do this, what happens that the apps that you will see from the store, they will have a tablet kind of UI. So that is the only difference. And the size of the text in the apps also decreases. So let, let it uh, boot up and then we can check. So here we are. <clears throat> Now, if we go to see, so as you can see, the size of the text has decreased. It has become smaller. Now, if I go to personalization start, I'll you will see that uh, you can fit the similar number of tiles. So number of tiles that you can fit in a row. That remains the same. But only thing is different is the, that uh, text size has uh, decreased. And if I if I uh, open, let's say, so you can see the UI, the UI has changed here. It is the kind of tablet UI that we can 
see on uh, you know windows 10 tablets so that is the only difference that will cause so <clears throat> but uh, if you, let's say if you want to use uh, on a no, smaller device if the text size has decreased and if you want to increase the text size what you can do is you can go to uh, ease of access sorry ease of access and from here you can text scaling you can increase the text size as well so that that can really help here so this is uh, I mean a tip from us so uh, let's say if you have used the settings to get a phablet UI but the size text size has decreased a lot and you want to increase it you can go to ease of access to the more options and then you can uh, do a text scaling so hope you have liked this tutorial and uh, you can get a, I mean a different kind of UI a new UI on your device so with that uh, we come to the end of this tutorial stay tuned for more Thanks for watching.